when do boys stop growing growth during puberty happens over an extended period so it can be difficult to know when it has finished we explain what to expect and how to know when boys are likely to stop growing every individual grows at different rates and puberty begins and ends at different times for every body puberty can last anywhere from 2 to 5 years so it is not always easy to predict when it will end a boy's body goes through many changes during puberty these changes can be embarrassing or confusing but the process happens to everyone and knowing what to expect can help some facts on when boys stop growing how long puberty lasts and general development depends on a range of factors for boys there is some evidence that being overweight or obese means that puberty is likely to begin at the older age puberty lasts 2 to 5 years for both boys and girls boys tend to start puberty around a year later than girls this means that boys may be shorter than girls of a similar age for 1 to 2 years when do boys typically fully mature puberty is the process of growth and change that happens in the body as boys become adults puberty is different for everyone and can start at any age between 8 to 14 The average age of for boys to show the first signs of puberty is around 12 years old. About 1 year after girls begin puberty. The fastest rate of growth is usually 1 to 2 years after puberty has started. Developing physically into an adult takes 2 to 5 years. Most boys will stop growing taller by age 16. and will usually have developed fully by 18 onset of puberty and ethnicity there is more research on the age that puberty begins in girls than there is for boys however a study by the american academy of pediatrics found that african american boys are likely to start puberty earlier than hispanic or caucasian boys What are the genetic factors? Genes play a role and parental height is a good indicator of how tall a child will be. A way to judge roughly how tall a boy will become become is to add together the height of the mother and father in inches. Divide this number by 2. Add 2.5 inches. This calculation is approximate and in general It is not possible to predict height accurately. Growth does tend to follow a curve. However, so if a person regularly plots a boy's height on a graph throughout their childhood, it may be possible to track where the line is likely to end up. Chronic illnesses such as severe arthritis and genetic conditions such as Down syndrome can cause a person to be shorter in adult adulthood than would otherwise be expected average height in boys average height varies across the world in the united states the average height for an adult man is 5 feet 9 inches or 70.8 inches This average is found by adding the height measurements of a group of people together and then dividing by the number of people surveyed. It does not mean that people above or below this height are unusually tall or small. It is important to remember that everyone is different. At what age do the genitals finish growing? For boys one of the first signs of puberty is the growth of the testicles and development of pubic hair the genitals grow throughout puberty because puberty ends at different ages for different people 
there is no set age at which the genitals will have completely developed once puberty is complete the genitals are usually fully developed puberty usually takes around four years the key stages of development of the genitals for boys after one year of puberty the penis and testicles begin to grow in size the genitals continue to grow for a further one to two years around four years after puberty begins the growth of the genitals should be complete when does body hair growth stop pubic hair usually grows first followed by underarm hair after about a year facial hair and other body hair will develop after around two years of puberty development of body hair will usually stop at the end of puberty what might impair growth rates factors such as diet and environment can affect growth worldwide children with diets that cause nutritional deficiencies or malnutrition may not grow to be as tall or strong as those who have had plentiful and balanced meals illnesses genetic conditions and use of some medications such as corticosteroids can all slow or limit growth an imbalance of hormones in the body might slow or speed up growth a parent or caregiver may wish to seek advice from their doctor if a boy is growing much faster or slower than expected is much shorter or taller than other children their age is growing very tall despite having shorter parents has not started puberty by age 14 an x-ray of the hand and wrist can help judge how much more a child will grow